Hello guys, welcome back, and today I'm just going to be showing you this cool laptop that is really worth it for $500. Um, I'm going to ask for excuse my mic, I am currently using the laptop's mic, so just for an example, this is what the laptop mic will sound like. So yeah, and let's get straight into it. So basically, let me explain, this laptop is really good for $500. It has a i5 and an i5 with 8 gigabytes of RAM and so I put 8 gigabytes of RAM plus as a 1650 uh, G Force. This is really good for $500. I've seen a lot of laptops that are like $700 in their worst years. And it has a very big screen display with a nice keyboard and I think it's lovely. And you have the option to turn your touchpad off or on, so if you want to like use touchpad or not. So basically, all gameplay recorded on this, on recorded is also on the laptop, on the laptop. And I don't know what to say. It's a really good laptop. This video is just my recommendation on a five hundred dollar laptop that you should totally invest in or get if you're trying to game. Um, I do recommend getting a storage in for it because it only has 258 gigabytes of storage and this laptop can basically run like most games in the AAA titles. Um, as I have played Rust on this laptop, it's been good and I've played a couple other games. But let me tell you this laptop, definitely worth it for $500. And once again, you can like an i5 and a 1650 and this laptop got like $700-$800 out there that barely even compared to what this laptop is. So, yeah, a really good $500 laptop. It actually has an office and a gaming mode, so if you more likely to work on it, you can switch it to that mode and um, make it better. Um, with an 8 gigabytes of RAM, so you can do a lot with that. You know, some laptops have like 4 or 6 gigabytes, and they're like 9 gigabytes. It's crazy, though. So, honestly, best $500 laptop out here. Um, the fans are really great if you're wondering about that, you can allow gaming laptops that have fans that can sometimes be really loud and annoying while gaming. Um, I actually haven't had any issues with the fans, they've been, I mean they kept my laptop cool and they are really good. And if you don't have any experience with gaming laptops, basically for maximum FPS, keep your charging cable in and it will get you maximum FPS. And I've kept this laptop on like two days in a row, all day and it has not gotten hot, like at all. So really good. And once again, you can do this for school work, and then you can play games on here. Still recommend getting that on like, terabyte storage. I should be showing some photos of the laptop in the video or some videos. But man, really good laptop. And I might have this as a gameplay section here. So, yeah. Once again, all footage of videos recorded using the laptop so I can see smooth gameplay. Um, playing Split Gate Arena, if you guys are wondering, having fun with this game. And man, uh, I'm loving this laptop. Really good, highly recommended $500. This is a review. Um, also, for the people that I am my subscribers, basically, this is the most my subscribers. For anybody that is with me, I'm currently on vacation, so I can't post like gaming videos like I think we do. So I'm on vacation right now, so I won't be doing any gaming videos on days. I typically post every week, but this time I took a week off. Once again, only because I'm on vacation, I can't post gaming videos. And I recently got this laptop for my birthday, and I'm like, dang. This is a laptop for $500. It's a very good laptop, and people should really buy it. I've watched other cheap laptop videos and they're saying like oh this $800 laptop, $800 laptop is really good and it has the same specs as this laptop but it has like 4 gigabytes of RAM and I'm like why does that cost so much why is that at that point might as well be an $800 PC but yeah really good laptop and I'm also on vacation so uploads won't be very frequent I doubt I'm even going to upload any videos after this um, until like a week so it might be another like 2 week period Actually, like next week, I should be uploading videos and next week. I'm trying to do the Valorant montage out or some Valorant gameplay or something. I'm gonna try. Um, and you might also want to get a microphone for this laptop because I've heard that the microphone is kind of eh. So you might want to get a microphone. Microphone. 
it's really good. Um, this this laptop microphone is not that good. It comes with a webcam. Or that it comes with a webcam. Laptop speakers are really good. And about a 90% keyboard, I would say. Not exactly a 100% keyboard, kind of like a 90% keyboard. Um, but it's basically a 100%. It just has like little, yeah, you'll see. I'll show pictures of it once again. But really good laptop, man. Really good laptop. Have a good day, and goodbye.